morning we're talking about Clash of Clans. Clash of Clans is a little cartoony game with your own village based on the village. And you have to gain resources which are gold, elixir and gems. But you do have to pay for gems. It is all about attacking the other bases in a cartoony way. So Tom, where can we find this game? You can find it on the App Store and the Play Store. But I do have to warn you, it has in-app purchases. Here are my three favourite things about the game. I like when you attack the other villagers, it's in a cartoony way. And I also like how there's no hackers since Supercell made it foolproof. So Tom, this all sounds really cool, but what are some things that you don't like about this game? There's only really one, because it takes forever to upgrade everything. It takes up to one minute to three days. That is a long time. I know. Three days. My pro gamer tip is, you have to use your gems wisely, because you only have few of them. Now our next game is Marvel Contest of Champions. Now this game may be for our older viewers, as it is a bit scary. Now this game is a one-on-one -on -one styled battle game with all of your favourite Avengers and supervillains, really. So in this game, as you progress, you'll collect various coins, crystals and bonuses to upgrade your team of Avengers to take on some pretty scary villains. So where can you get it? You can get this game on all app stores for free, but there are some in-app purchases available, so if you're gonna get those, be sure to ask a parent first. Now my favorite things about this game is, firstly, the gameplay. A gameplay is important in any real game, really, and in this game, it is awesome. You get to have some really dynamic battles between your favorite superheroes or supervillains, and you get to unlock your superpowered ability, which happens after getting a high strike bonus. You can then unlock a superpowered ability. Now, for my favorite, Iron Man, he gets to fire his hand repulses into the enemy and do some major damage. And probably the second coolest part is the characters themselves. Now, I think characters are important in any real game like this, and these ones are great. You get to see your cool Avengers like Iron Man, Hawkeye and Thor and Captain America, and some cooler, lesser known characters like The Vision or Black Panther. Sounds great, but what don't you like about it? Probably my main issue with this game is the fact that it requires an internet connection whenever you want to play it. So if you want a game where you can play whenever and wherever you want to do it, this might not be the game for you. My pro gamer tip for this game is to as soon as the game starts, just go straight in and try and attack quickly so you can unlock your superpowered ability. And once that's unlocked, wait for the enemy to have their guard down so that you can use its full damage. Game on.